corner, Rafael Akayev from Azerbaijan. Gustavo, nice. he is from the Dominican Republic and uh, he was inspired to train karate after watching Bruce Lee and Jackie Chan like many of us. Yeah, that includes me. So you see the very yeah. light on their feet, traditional sort of karate bounce. Uh, that usually allows a fighter to blitz in effectively. You can see he's kind of testing, Gustavo's testing his opponent to see what Gaev does. And he's got great movement as well. Yeah, there you go, little feints and fakes little trying faint. to figure out what the love opponent's it. doing. I love it. And not many fighters use that. It's so effective. And look how Gustav, oh, how he stays just outside his reach again, Agaev. Yeah, bringing his foot to the outside so that he can line up the straight punch. You can see the concentration on these fighters, just kind of looking for any type of flinch, any type of movement. Yeah, and he has to watch out because Gustavo, wow, nice there, has the reach advantage over him arm length, so that's why he stays a little further away from his opponent. Now what you're watching, see, throws are allowed. Yes, they are standing up, there will be no ground and powder. Throws are allowed. You have a five second rule once you get to the ground. Just a reminder, this is a ten point must system. <laughs> We're looking for effective striking, effective control. Both fighters has great distance, you see it, right? One moves forward, the other one identically moves backwards. And another takedown here, beautifully moved to the side mount, and now he will rain down some punches for five seconds. Yes, if the grounded opponent is unable to protect himself on the ground from additional blows, the bout will be ended by the referee. 